Hello, this is Jirka from Revo.com and in this tutorial I will show you how to work with our plugin inside Cinema 4D. So if you already installed our plugin, you can find it here in the extensions tab. So here's the Revo PBR loader. If you don't install it yet, you can download it from our website realworldtextures.com slash plugins. If I open the plugin, you will see window like this and first thing you may change is default rendering software. So I will change it, for example, to V-Ray, hit OK, and I have to reopen the plugin now, and you can see the V-Ray is set up like a default rendering software. So I will change it to Corona again, and open plugin again. If you want to upload our material, you have to hit the Browse button and find the folder with the Revolt materials. You can select this folder, and you can see all materials are loaded into this list. If I click on the materials, you can even see little previews here, which can help you to navigate through the list. I can select multiple materials or all materials. If you add some new material to the folder, you can hit this refresh button and it will update the list. If you have, for example, some materials in different folder, you can add them to the list via this button. And of course, in the end, you can clean the list by this button. So I will upload the materials again. And also there are some options, which maps will be, will be included in the loaded material. These options are up to you. And finally, I can load the material by clicking on, on this load selected materials button. So you can see all materials are visible here in material manager. And one thing I would like to point out is that uh, always check the default value of the displacement because in general it's set up to one centimeter so for example for this floor it will be maybe too much so i will decrease it like this so this value is up to you so check it and we can check also how the materials will look in the final rendering so i will add some simple objects here like this sphere i will increase the segments a little bit so it looks smoother and I will apply the material on the object. And since we are in Corona, I will add Corona sky. I will change the type of the sky to HDRI and I will find some HDRI here in the cinema content browser. So I will apply, for example, this one and we can start interactive rendering. So you can see material is there. It looks really nice. I can check, for example, this material with opacity map. Yeah, it looks really nice. Also here, you can change the displacement. It's up to you. And also I can check the last one, which should be some kind of fabric. So you can see everything works perfectly. Just one thing, if you are user of the Octane, sometimes this previews here in Material Manager can be a black. It's not a mistake. You can just update the preview of the material by clicking on this material icon and change default preview object for example to something different like sphere sorry cube and change it back to the sphere and material should be updated or the preview of the material should be updated yeah we are working on this little bug but uh everything every map should be uploaded perfectly so don't worry so i hope you like this new plugin don't forget to subscribe to our channel hit the bell button and like thank you for your watching